I was able to get a couple of the Michaels $4 grab boxes and bags. I got one box and one bag. It was actually kind of funny. When I was checking out, the cashier said, oh, only two. And I said, yeah, I mean, it's the first day that you guys have them out. And I wanted to make sure that I left plenty for other people. And he told me that most people just grab as many as they can possibly fit. But that he was trying to lobby his store to limit to four or five boxes per person. I don't know if that's actually going to go anywhere, but I actually kind of like that idea that you could only get four to five boxes. And of course, that's per day, so you could always go back. But again, I'm not one of those people who needs like a whole ton of stuff. But I did get one bag and one box. So let me show you what's in the bag first. Okay, I grabbed this bag because it had wrapping paper in it. This one, I thought this was really pretty. It's pink with little snowman and Santa on it. And this was originally $5, as was this one. And this is the one that I really liked. It's that brown wrapping paper, and it's got snowmen and Christmas trees on it. I have plenty of wrapping paper, but I'm also of the thought process that you can never have too much wrapping paper. And I would rather have too much than not enough. Okay, so here's the bag. I got, ooh, look at this big pretty bow. This big pretty gold bow. And this was originally 15 I got, oh, this is exciting. Isabel will be very excited about this. It's the ice tower. This was originally $30. It's one of those foam sets that you'd put together. And it comes with, uh, it requires glue and scissors, apparently. But yeah, that's really neat. We'll, we'll have fun with that. I got this, oh, and this is um like velour, kind of, is what it feels like. But it's ribbon. It's very pretty. I could probably wrap this around a wreath form and make something very pretty out of this. And this was originally 15 I got another big pretty gold bow. I got a little unicorn pick. This is cute. I can, um, this was originally 6 I can put this in the little tree that my kids got for upstairs for next year and I can slide that in there. I got, oh, here's another unicorn pick. I got some coiled garland. That's pretty. I can add that to my mantle most likely and just wrap it around the other garland that I have. That could be really pretty. Here's some more picks. Here it just looks like um, pine needles with some pine cones. Here's a few pine cones. Oh, that's pretty. I like that a lot. It's got the little holly berries and pine cones and some white flowers. That's very pretty. I can make something out of that. Here's some more ribbon. This was 10. I don't know if you can see it. This is cream and it's got white lace. This is very, very pretty. I like this a whole lot. Here's some more of that uh, velour ribbon. I've already got some ideas. Actually, I could probably use this red ribbon for a Valentine's Day project. I got, this is cute. I'll give this to my daughter. It's one of those little pre-lit cutouts. And it looks like a little kitty who's got antlers on it. That's very cute. She'll like that. I've got some of this very pretty gold uh, ribbon. Here's thinner ribbon that's also gold. This will be good for accents. I got a little snowman, one of the pre-lit ones. And a little gingerbread person. We've got some glass ornaments. This will be good. This is very, these are very nice. Here's a little a Santa Claus pick. Or maybe a little Santa gnome. Oh, he's broken. I could probably, if the arm's in there, I can fix it though. It's a little gingerbread person. That's really cute. I like that a lot. Hopefully the arm's in there so I can fix it. Here's a 
Well, I guess this is a coffee pot ornament. I guess that's what that is. That's cute. Oh, that's pretty. It's a little ballerina pick. There's another white one, and there's one in pink as well. Two in pinks. Here's one that says Our First Christmas, and it has the year on it. I'll probably give that one away. Here's some wire. Here are more of the Santa Gnome picks. And unfortunately, I don't see the cookie's arm in here. That's unfortunate. There's this little train pick. Wesley will like this one a whole lot. And the last one is this ornament that has an X on it. That's everything that came in the bag. Give me just a second and I'll pull out the box. Okay, and here is the box. So let's see. There is, oh nice, an advent calendar. We have one that we keep downstairs, but this could be nice to put upstairs in the kids' playroom. That's really cute. And this was um, originally $10. I got some more of the garland. And here's just a different kind of the garland. That is really funny. A hot dog ornament. Wesley will like that a whole lot. Another little train pick. Another little pink ballerina. Here's a little Santa. Oh, he doesn't light up though, so I'd have to change the batteries in this one, I think. Here's some pretty white flowers. These don't look inherently Christmassy to me, so these could really be used for several different things, I'm sure. Here's, I don't know if he's supposed to be a reindeer or a moose. He's cute. It looks like he's missing one of his antlers. Here's another one of the little coffee pot ornaments. Here is... Some little fuzzy pom-poms. Oh, that's pretty. A little angel Christmas ornament. I guess you could probably write something here that looks like something's supposed to be intended to be written here. I like that. Oh, how pretty are these little, this little pick. It's got red and these are clear little berries. I'll make use out of that. Here's a pick that has bells and a pine cone and the pine needles. Some gold ribbon and it's got the silver ribbon, uh, silver stripe in the middle. Here's a little mini Christmas stocking that says it has the letter O on it. Here are some little mini Christmas ornaments. These are very pretty. These will go well upstairs on their little tree. Some more of the garland. In fact, I could probably string some of this garland on our actual Christmas tree. Here's a little pick with this little one on it. That's really cute. Here is a wreath hanger. This is actually metal and sturdy. I usually use the ones from the Dollar Tree if I use them, but um, this is a really nice one. Here's a little Christmas ornament. Here's some more of those little ballerina picks. I'll have to find something to do with these. Here's a felt stocking maker kit. See, the things like this that are a craft, I really enjoy because I can give them to Isabel, who's my kid who really likes crafts. 
Oh, I like this one a lot. This pick says joy. I like that one. I got this fun little donut pick. Oh yeah, I can, I'm already starting to get ideas for a centerpiece with some of this stuff. This is just some bags. This one says, treat your elf. And the other one on this side says, get your jingle on. That's really cute. Oh, apple spice candles. You know what? I'm all about that. That smells good. I'm, I'm very pleased with this one. And this was originally six. Here is one of those little uh, tiny treasures. It's a polar bear and a little polar bear on top. I could probably make a mason jar snow globe out of this. Here are some more candles. This is the woodland pine, so it smells like pine tree. I have never been the biggest fan of that, so I probably will end up giving this one away. Uh, look, these are gift card holders. Isn't that cute? That's nice, a bag of bows. We usually don't put too many bows on our stuff um, because the cat likes to chew on them. <laughs> Here is a little, oh, it's a, like a little squishy, but it's a keychain. Oh, I know a little girl who will love that. Here's another one of the light-up ones. This one's a bell. This one also looks like it needs batteries. Oh, actually, it looks like the tab might still be in it, so maybe it just has never actually started. Here are some window gel clings. I'll put these out next year. These are very cute. Here is a little ornament frame for your pet. It says best friend, friends. That's cute. Here is a pick of just one antler. Here's some more of that velour ribbon. Oh, here's like a real fluffy, fuzzy white ribbon. That's really pretty too. And I got another Santa Claus. Another little elf pick. This one's a little dog. It's one of those light up things again. These are some picks that spell out joyful. I think that's really cute. Here is just a plain white snowman. I guess we can uh, paint this. He's really cute. Here's another one of those best friends picture frames. Here is some more ribbon. This one is just thin gold. This one's slightly thicker gold. And then this is another thin gold. Here is a white ballerina. This is a watch? Or maybe it's just a watch band? It says it's a watch, but it's got little llamas on it. That's really cute. That's real cute. Oh, well these Christmas cards are very pretty. It's a, and it'll say on the inside, with wishes for a wonderful new year. This was originally 15. I bought some Christmas cards for 25 cents um, at Walmart, but these are very pretty. So it's always good to have Christmas cards on hand. And that's very, very pretty. Here's another little Santa light up. And the top part is missing, but it's one of those big oversized pens. And it's got penguins and snowflakes on it. Okay, guys, so that's what I got in the two that I got. Benji has a doctor's appointment tomorrow, and there is a Michaels nearby there. I might stop to see, because um, it's a different Michaels, and maybe grab one more box, but I probably won't. I'm pretty happy with everything that I got. All right, guys, so if you were able to find any of the $4 grab bags or boxes, let me know. I'd like to see what you got. All right, guys, I'll talk to you next time. Bye.